Good afternoon. Deputies say those men drowned in an irrigation ditch in an area where a lot of people walk. Friends are shocked something like this could happen to someone who was so athletic. News 13 So Young Kim spoke with them today. Kim, we've learned the owner of the dog walked along this ditch every day. Right here is where deputies say the two men jumped in after the dog. As you can see, it's a very steep drop, about 10 feet to the water. When Chris Holland's girlfriend didn't hear from him last Wednesday, she started to worry. Why haven't you called me? It's been almost a day. That's not right. The last she had heard, he was going for a walk with his friend Brian Lang near where they lived in Bernalillo. Sandoval County Sheriff's deputies say they found signs of the two men early the next morning at the edge of a ditch. We found the clothing along the ditch bank where they had actually entered the canal. Deputies Say they believe trouble started when Ling jumped in after his dog. Got in trouble after he got in the water and couldn't get out and couldn't rescue the dog. And Holland jumped in after Ling. They both ended up downstream. Looks like they suffered from hypothermia and drowned. Ling's friends say he lived near that ditch bank for decades and knew it well, even warning others. Be careful. This is it's very dangerous when the water is running. It can be very, very dangerous. You he worked for the state's Department of Game and Fish as a biologist for two decades, loved the outdoors, and was a great athlete. He always loved soccer, you know, uh, running, uh, bikes. Holland's girlfriend says he was also active. He did walk the dogs a lot. But, but deputies say the cold water. The water temperature will range from high 30s to mid 40s. And fast current. Even though it looks calm, it's still moving pretty quickly were just too powerful. A lesson to everyone that ditches can be deadly, even to the most experienced swimmers. The debris that can be under the water could actually trap somebody and pull them under. Holland is from Arkansas. He was visiting his mother and sister and had been in town for the past few months. Ling was his landlord. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks so young. Now officials tell us the water where the men went in is about 15 feet deep. They say these ditches are deceivingly dangerous.